delighted to welcome a new Rocket Boom correspondent to the Rocket Boom Field Correspondent Flock. He is Tim Brunsden and he's in Liverpool, and that's in England in case you haven't heard of it. Tim takes us for a spin around Liverpool's 13th biennial. Spin being the operative word here. I'm David Allen, a architect at Diller's Capidio in Renfro, uh, here at uh, Arboris Laitai, a, a project um, we're doing for the Liverpool Biennial. The idea of this project uh, continues a, a sort of research in our office on issues of the natural and the unnatural. And in this case, we decided to make a, a park an unnatural park where we, we built a, a, a grove of 17 uh, hornbeam trees and within that grove three of them very slowly rotate. Uh, at first walking by you might not notice anything is wrong or different, um, but if you stand still for a second you'll see a tree either slightly following you, the, the shadow of a tree that typically moves very slowly over the day moving a little bit faster. To, to pull this off, there was a huge amount of, of work and infrastructure and planning that all um, ideally just completely disappears. Uh, you don't see any of it. So under, underneath um, where I'm sitting right now is a huge concrete pit um, with a mechanical turntable uh, located uh, almost um, three meters underground um, that supports a large steel planter uh, that the tree sits in and then the only um, sort of architectural detail in the project is just a small a steel and rubber edge where the grass meets the grass. Um, otherwise everything is buried from view. It was commissioned as a temporary project but the infrastructure is really there uh, such that hopefully it could last a little longer if, if uh, the city of Liverpool enjoys it and, and decides to, uh, to maintain it. Who knows what will happen to these trees that are constantly spinning. It's a kind of science experiment in a way to see uh, what, what, the, what the result will be.